the Getaway Series is proudly sponsored by Crown Precision Arms. Where's your dead cutie? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> I'll give you a hug. Look at this. This is where he stood. Look right here. Look at the scrape marks. Yep. This is a lung on the, on the grass here. You see that footprint as you yeah, jumped took away? Yeah, it took off. I, heard, I told you I heard bushes crash. Yeah. At 20 yards. Hey, at least it didn't go very far. Well done, buddy. Well <laughs> Thank done. Thank you. This is the hunt of a lifetime, you know that. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> and that angle you had to shoot through was... Yeah, and look at the size of the horns on there. <laughs> cool. I got, I got hard. <laughs> well done. Once, once I got on the sticks, my heart calmed down, and I, saw, I felt I good. I was just breathing. worried about. I couldn't really tell exactly where, you know, when you oh told me God, where to look. What a beautiful cutie! Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> well done, my friend. Nice one. Light up. Good deal. Hey, you Thank you. Man, yeah. Thank you. Good yeah. job, buddy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice one. Very, Very nice. Yeah. Well, um, Sean, what a hunt, buddy. Yes. Um, definitely. We 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 stalked it for about 400 yards, and we got to the spot where we where we thought they were and. And we literally could see from the middle of his belly to the front of his shoulder. And we couldn't see the head, we couldn't see the top of his back. It was in the bush. There was literally a little hole in there. All right. Um, tell, us, tell us what went through your mind when you, when you, when you shot there. Well, uh, I, I was having a real hard time because I couldn't see the whole animal because we had such a small window to shoot through. And once you pointed out where the shoulder was between the two trees and, and all that, we. Yeah. Got lined up and, and uh, took the shot, but uh, magnificent animal. Yeah, it was great. Everything came together. You know, sometimes you do this and it doesn't work, and then other times we do this absolutely right. The wind was perfect <clears throat> in our favor. He stood there. He had his head down for a minute, and I, I just saw the bases. I never saw the tips, um, but I saw the bases, how thick they were, and I said, that's a good cootie. And you had a you had a little gap, a little window, probably about a, a, a foot across right. that you shot through, and um, you did an absolutely splendid job. But great shooting, like really calm. When when we got there, I could hear your heartbeat. And then once you got on the sticks, I think you they were, could hear my heart beating in the truck. <laughs> <laughs> you had I calmed down, but yeah. you had once you got on the sticks, you were fine. And, yeah. And then, the, um, what do you think about a 375? Well, the Crown Precision 375 definitely put him down. I think he went. 20 yards and, yeah. and 
ran over a tree and about, you know, looks like somebody drove a truck through here. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, it was awesome. Just yeah. really awesome. Your first goodie. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> Thank you. Congratulations. <laughs> Job well done. Let me tell you this. It's an absolute splendid hunt. Um, it's something that, that you'll probably cherish for a long time. It's definitely the hunt of a lifetime. Um, just incredible. Catch me howling at the moon.